guys right over here we have the 2024 hyundai kona hyundai kona electric limited full front wheel drive this comes at a price point of $31,977. Not only that, but you're going to get an odometer reading of 8,472 miles. You're going to get the cyber gray metallic exterior with the gray interior and front wheel drive once again for that drivetrain. Not only that, but here at the Seward Car Company, due to us being on a county island, you get to save around 2 to 3% when you purchase a vehicle from us compared to the other dealerships around the area. So you're going to save a lot of money due to us being on a county island. Now with that as well, some of the specs on this vehicle include the MSRP, which is $41,045. You're going to get 261 miles of battery, 201 horsepower, and a five-year, 60,000-mile basic factory warranty. You get that very distinct um, headlight bar at the front, looking very nice. As well as that, you're going to have your front-facing view camera. It's very, it's like, you can barely even see it. It's really nice as well. It's embedded into the body of the car. You're also going to get your front sensors, charging port, aluminum alloy wheels down over there. 360 degree view camera system, keyless entry for the driver and passenger door handles, and a moonroof on top or a sunroof. But you also are going to get that back tail or that tail light strip right over here with the Hyundai Kona badges. Looking fantastic. Love it. And you get that electric um, little badge right over there with your rear sensors. Now, opening this up, you're going to have some cargo space with that cargo cover. Very nice, looking very sleek. A little bit newer. I like the new design. I also got a new button for that. Go into the back. Let's lose that keyless entry real quick. Wow, okay. We're gonna get to that in just a second. That looks super sweet. So, going to the back, you can see that we also have the interior. It's all gray leather, it looks fantastic. You get two USB-C ports, and this also fits your phone, so if you just wanna keep it down there, you can. And you're also gonna be getting your AC, looking fantastic. Now, pulling this down, you get your cup holders. That feels new, feels very solid. Going to the front, you see we got power adjustable seating for the driver, a little bit for the passenger. But if you go inside, you could check this out. So the steering wheel looks completely new, okay? Completely new design, very nice. But if we actually, whoa, that actually sounds pretty cool. The base in this thing was pretty nice. But you get adaptive cruise control, you get lane assist and steering assist, you get all that good stuff. This has basically the same shifter as you would have in the Hyundai Ionic. Ionic 5 or Ionic 4. You're also going to have your little digital cluster system right up here. It's not little actually, it's pretty big. It looks fantastic. You can go between those different menus. Check out that safety. How about we actually click OK. Let's go to that infotainment display. Newer system when it comes to the driving convenience and safety. A driving convenience is smart cruise control, highway driving assist and auto speed change. We can go to different driving modes, and that's very nice, actually. And if we go back real quick, let's actually do that one more time. This is a very cool car. So driving safety looks great. you got forward safety, forward safety with warning timing, lane safety, blind spot view monitor, blind spot safety, and safe exit safety. So we got that good stuff. Speed limit warning, you can change that to however you'd like. Driver attention warning, so that's very nice. Parking safety. You get the monitor as well as rear safety and rear cross traffic alert with parking distance warning. So yeah, you got all those good things. This does come with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on the infotainment display, just letting you know. Going down from there, you can see you have the AC system. It's got that nice brush metallic look all over. The dials feel very smooth, feel a little bit more durable compared to the other ones that they had in previous Konas. You get two USB-C ports, looking super cool. I love the way that it has a different type of system. Wow, that's very interesting. So you can go between charging or you can have the USB plus charging. So this will basically either take it off of Apple CarPlay and Android Auto or keep it on. Now with that, you're also going to have that 12 volt port. Just click that in. That is super cool. And right over here, you're also going to have a wireless charging pad. Down over here, you get heated and ventilated seats with a heated steering wheel, different driving modes. You got sport snow, normal, and eco. Shows you the different charging or the amount of battery that you have. So if we're in eco, you get 119. Go down to normal, 115. Sport is 112 miles of battery. You're also going to have these different types of cup holders. Very cool, so basically all you do is just press those and it'll come out. You also get a little bit of cargo space down over there. And yeah, you also get this little center console. So if you have any other, oh, and also, let's keep going up. Get your lights up here. You got the blue link system, 
and you also get that sunroof. So if you have any other questions, please let us know. This is a beautiful Kona. We only have one of these, and I know for sure that this is gonna be sold probably within the next week or two. So if you wanna get your hands on one of these things, definitely let us know, and we'll see you guys in the next video.